Are cockroaches really becoming immune? To verify, we spoke to University of Georgia entomologist Dan Souter and arrow exterminator Ben Dupree. Chelsea Bineford joins us live in studio to tell us what she found out. Well, Frank, really, this was for my own sanity. I had to dig a little bit deeper into this new CNN article published last week. It's based off a new study done by researchers at Purdue University in Indiana. Here's what we found out. They're creepy, they're crawly, and they could be taking over. They're really diverse group of insects. Cockroaches, big brown bugs we often find in basements and bathrooms, an insect that carries bacteria and one that no one really likes. So when this new CNN article popped up online that claims cockroaches are becoming immune to pesticides, a lot of people probably panicked. But is it true? It's based on this new study from Purdue University scientists that say German cockroaches, or ones we typically find in our kitchens or small warm areas of our house, are becoming harder to eliminate as they develop a cross resistance to pesticides. The concept of, of insecticide resistance is that a group of insects today is more tolerant to the same quantity of insecticide that they encounter than any previous generation. That's Dan Souter, a University of Georgia entomology professor. He explained that this concept is all based on genetics. If you spray 100 roaches with a chemical, it may kill 95 of them. The remaining five are resistant to that pesticide and then may pass that gene off to their offspring. So over time, the species may develop a tolerance. We try to tell the guys to keep two. We have two or three different products on, uh, on hand at all times, just in case they run across that. Ben Dupree with Arrow Exterminator says his guys use a combination of products on roaches. So if one's immune to one thing, another may knock it out. Unfortunately, in the Purdue study, scientists found that some roaches resisted a combination of three chemicals. So we verified, yes, some cockroaches are becoming immune to some types of pesticides, but it's not the end of the world. Purdue scientists say combining chemical treatments with traps and vacuums should still be an effective way to exterminate or eliminate the pests. Scary stuff right there. Well, that Purdue research team also concluded that the roach resistance problem is worse in low income areas and other places where effective pest control isn't available. Frank, back to you at the desk. Mm, thank you, Chelsea. <laughs> now, if you see an article like this one that gets under your skin, like this one did for Chelsea, you can ask us to verify by sending us an email or Facebook message. We will take a closer look in our 13 WMAZ poll about which bug most of you really don't like. Yeah, it appears the old cockroach came out number one.